Uh, I have an interest in nursing and allied health allows you to expand on your skills and develop an understanding of, of what nursing is and it's really beneficial for when I go to uni and because I do want to be in nursing. I chose allied health because I thought it would be a good way to see what the healthcare or health industry is about and broaden my skills on first aid and learn different techniques on how to care for people. Well, in year 10 I went to a nursing home in Echuca and that was really good to see what it was like and I also went to a nursing home last year and I did it when school was finished so I didn't miss any school and then this year I went to St John's Body San Diego and that was by far my favourite because I was in a different ward every day and I was learning so many skills and in year 12 it was really good because I sort of knew what I wanted to do and it helped me sort of cement what I wanted to do and yeah. <laughs> I in year 10 did my work placement at a local nursing home as well. I got to communicate with the residents and that was really what we focused on in year 10. I also did a little bit of minor rehabilitation with the residents and that was really gave me a good insight as to what skills you needed in the actual industry to, which broadened on what we learnt in the classroom. Last year I did my placement at Duke Regional Health which was amazing because I worked with cardiac patients and did their rehab and learned about how they're restricted by their conditions. Um, yeah, it was a good insight. And I went in as well to the midwifery ward and I got to see ultrasounds, blood being taken, babies and I saw patients who were in car accidents and what they had to do to be able to walk again and have no more mobility and it was, it was really good. When you first hand get to care for patients and you do first aid and take bloods, do blood pressures and it's like you're in a real hospital so you learn things first really beneficial but, and when you go on placement you know what the, what the equipment is and how to use it and that. Yeah we have all medical grade equipment which enables us to go from the classroom to the actual industry and know exactly what we're doing and how to correctly take measurements of the patients and it's really beneficial to go from a doll to a patient and not have any issue in using different types of technology. Good afternoon, uh, my name is Kane Anderson. I am the Allied Health Trainer here at St. Joseph's College in Echuca and have been since its inception six years ago. Um, we started our program with year 10 and 11 students and we had 15 students initially for our first year of our program. And six years later we have grown that until 90 students where we're maxed out and we're at its capacity and unfortunately um, can't take any more students than that. The last couple of years we have been very fortunate to build a new trade training centre where at school now we have a three bed hospital ward uh, which is really giving the students a great opportunity for hands on clinical based learning prior to them getting out and doing their work experience what is a recommendation and a requirement for, the, for their allied health component of this course as well. Uh, the students do a range of things um, from being involved with the clerical side of any sort of health organisation right through to acute care nursing skills at the year 12 level where they really get some hands on training and learn a lot of the skills that they require to go on and become hopefully quality nurses or doctors or physios down the track which most of our students do. We've had a, a great success. Um, a lot of our students do go on to further education at universities. We are currently having students doing medicine, nursing, physio, occupational therapy, and we also have had students go out and do gap years as allied health assistants and AINs in the Echuca Regional Health here, which has been fantastic. And Regional Echuca Regional Health have been a, a wonderful supporter and partner of ours. Uh, they place our students uh, every week for us. We have students out in the hospital learning the skills that uh, is required and we also have other 
wonderful support by local businesses in Echuca, um, such as physiotherapists and occupational therapists in their private clinics that also take our students and give them a wonderful opportunity. Uh, this program is just going from strength to strength and it's been an absolute privilege to be a part of it. Um, and I look forward to continuing to grow this program and encouraging more students to get, a, get along and be a part of it.